Hello, Noble. This is uh, Matthew Robert Payne, and this is a prophecy for you. I'll just dedicate this to the Lord. Uh, dear Father, I pray that uh, you'd give me a word for Noble. I want to bless him, encourage him, and lift his spirits up. In Jesus' name I ask. Amen. I see, um, I heard the word reckoning. Um, uh, something uh, in your life is going to come to a head and there's going to be a reckoning. Um, I'm not sure what that is. Um, I wouldn't worry about it. Um, it's just something's going to be solved, something that uh, has uh, eluded you for a little while. It, there's going to be a reckoning. It could be with a person uh, who uh, is... Uh, acting maliciously, um, it, things may come to a head, uh, or there could be some situation uh, that's going to come to a head. Um, but um, you know in advance that something's going to happen because I told you here. Um, I sense that uh, uh, you're a person who's uh, pressing into the Lord. Uh, I sense that uh, you're a person who uh, has developed intimacy uh, with Jesus and is uh, actively uh, pursuing Jesus. And I sense that, um, that Jesus is uh, very happy with you and uh, is pleased with um, your devotion to him. I sense that uh, there's uh, a season uh, that you're approaching of growth. Um, I can see uh, the Holy Spirit uh, ministering to you and uh, teaching you and giving you uh, revelation. Uh, I, um, I can see um, you getting revelation uh, out of the Bible and uh, out of uh, uh, different books. Um, I can see uh, the Holy Spirit uh, directing you uh, to uh, different sort of books and... Uh, and you uh, gaining uh, revelation uh, from from those books, but also uh, gaining revelation through the Word of God. I'm not sure if you've got a relationship where you can speak back and forth to the Holy Spirit. But uh, if you can uh, speak forth, back and forth to the Holy Spirit, uh, I sense that there's revelation coming that way too. Um, you're going to enter into a season of uh, growth, uh, a season of uh, revelation. Um, and... A lot of the revelation is going to be you. I'm not sure if you're a pastor uh, or a preacher or someone who ministers. But uh, uh, many times uh, the Lord will supply revelation and want us to share it. Uh, uh, that's what happens most times with me. Uh, I get revelation and I share it. Uh, but uh, on this instance, this season of growth uh, that you're going to have, uh, most of the rev revelation is going to be personal. It's going to be uh, for you, for your own uh, growth, uh, for your own life. And uh, you're not going to do anyone any damage if you do share it, uh, if if uh, you uh, get revelation and, and you love it and you want to share it. Um, 
you're not going to do anyone any damage. But um, different uh, to the past uh, where you shared your revelation, um, the Lord wants you to sit on this revelation and let it uh, flower within you and let it do its perfect work within you. Um, I, uh, I sense that uh, you're a real giving person and uh, you're um, a person who, who shares and, uh, and this would be quite different uh, for you to receive revelation and not to share it. And uh, so um, I want to uh, confirm with you uh, and repeat myself uh, with you that it's not going to do any one any damage uh, if you share it, uh, if you can't hold it in. But uh, if you do hold it in, uh, it's going to really benefit you. Um, I see, um, I see uh, the prophetic of your life. I can see you growing into in the prophetic. Uh, I can see uh, books uh, coming forth. Uh, I can see articles uh, coming forth. I can see you writing um, and ministering to people in writing. I can see at least a couple of books uh, you producing. Um, I can see uh, you uh, teaching. Uh, uh, once again, uh, I sort of sense that you are a pastor, uh, but um, uh, I'm not uh, particularly sure of, of the fact, but I can see you teaching uh, from, from a pulpit um, and uh, I can see um, the effect of the revelations that you get will come out in your preaching uh the the benefit the the growth the personal growth that uh you uh go through the growth uh that you experience in intimacy as a result of the revelations that's going to benefit your audience you're going to have a more rounded out, more mature um, aspect to you. And uh, this refreshing, this uh, personal growth, this uh, increased intimacy with the Lord has been something you've been desiring, something you've been praying for. And uh, the Lord has heard your prayers and uh, he's going to uh, come forth and uh, minister uh, to you and uh, it's going to be exciting uh, it'll be exciting for you uh, uh, so uh, that's uh, uh, basically uh, what I've got for you uh, a season of growth a season of increased intimacy uh, a season of uh, revelation uh, is going to come uh, forth for you. Uh, I'd love to uh, hear your feedback uh, if uh, if you've got any feedback for me. God bless.